What's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So yes, I am in the bathroom right now because I have decided to show you my updated version of my night skincare routine. And I remember the last time I filmed this was maybe like eight months ago. And I feel like part of my routine has kind of changed or at least like some of the products I've been using have changed. Whatever I'm doing right now with my skin, I feel like really is working for me because when I wake up in the morning, it's like, I feel like my skin is just very plump and it feels like it's kind of lifted. We're actually gonna start with cleaning my face because I have a face full of makeup. And recently I've actually been doing a lot of like alternating between products. I'm actually gonna first show you the couple of cleansers I've been using. These are the first three. This is rice niacinamide. I'm actually like kind of out, if you can tell. I really like this one. And I found this recently. It's a whipping foam for pore cleansing. I have also been using this one. This one's actually pretty old, so I'm kind of almost out, but I don't use this one a lot. And every like once a week, depending on skin situation, I like to use this Mixoon set. And I will basically do oil first, and then I will follow up with this. And there's no like specific order on which ones I alternate with. We're gonna first start by taking off my makeup. So I'm just basically going to use this Bethesda Micellar eye makeup remover and I find this really, really good. And then we're gonna be using this Kala brand makeup wipe. I feel like I've never felt like my skin has changed that much in such a short amount of time, but I'm also going to tell you in the end what I'm also doing very differently. This is not like something that I put on my skin. It's actually something that I take. I've never like tried taking off makeup through a camera before. So now that a majority is taken off and then I will use this to kind of just go over everything because I have contour and stuff. Ta-da, I am back to my own self. I'm pretty happy with however my skin is right now, even though I still actually have like quite some flaws here that I'm working on. Okay, so today for me is actually pore cleansing day. And cause I have dry skin, actually the pore cleansing face masks aren't the best choice for dry skin people cause it just kind of dries your skin even more. Just squeeze out about that much. Oh, that's such an odd angle. Oh my God. You see how like clean the skin is? It's crazy. All right, so today I'm not going to be using a sheet mask or anything, but I am actually going to be using a mousse mask. Also because I have to wash my hair and stuff, this one I'm supposed to keep it on for five to 10 minutes. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this on right now and then I'm gonna actually wear this while I take a shower and then I will wash it off at the end of my shower, so I won't be filming that part, obviously. And then I will meet you guys afterwards, like after the face mask is washed off for the product layering part. Okay, now that I have finished taking a shower, the first thing I'm gonna do is a toner. And this is still the Olay Niacinamide toner from eight months ago. I'm still using it, which is going to tell you this is one of my favorite products that I still haven't given up on. There are a couple of different um, serums that I've been kind of using and I use different ones every day. Lately, it's either the one that pairs with the niacinamide. This one, this one's like a vitamin A serum. This one is a vitamin A, C, and E serum. And this one is super matcha for pore tightening. And today, I kind of alternate between days. I used to be like, just get enough for my skin. And I realized that no, you don't just get enough. You cannot save on these products. Because if you don't put enough, it actually doesn't work as well. So I use an entire like, I don't know, tube. So today is this one, which means tomorrow is super matcha. And then the day after is going to be this one. Now. I'm going to blow my hair and then I'll finish up the rest of the layers after. All right, so for tonight, um, I will actually be using another layer of essence. Sometimes I use multiple layers of serums and one of the ones inside that I just showed you and one of these Mixoon products that were sponsored by YesStyle a while ago, which is the reason why I still haven't used a lot of it is because I don't use these every single day and I also sometimes like to layer these. So I'm gonna be using actually the Bean Essence one is actually out of the four. This one's actually my favorite. 
I'm gonna actually do two pumps today. This Bean Essence one, honestly, I like just, I don't know why, but I just really like this one. The last one I'm actually gonna be using, I believe I also stuck this in my video from eight months ago, also the night routine one. And I'm still using this and I actually just bought a bunch more. I think um, this cream actually is still my favorite. This one is a new brightening cream that I've been trying out. I still like this one the most. Cause honestly, like recently my skin has felt a little more like if I kind of touch my skin, it feels like there's more elastic. So I'm very happy with whatever I'm doing. I guess this is usually how I do my skincare at night. So it's one layer of toner and then one to three layers actually of serum. Two or three of these, or sometimes I won't layer these. I don't layer them every single day. So that's not like, it's not necessary, honestly. It's just, I have dry skin and sometimes a couple more layers of essence is okay for me. Okay, so the other thing that I've actually been doing different recently, like I've only started this like maybe for a month and I don't know if it's just me placeboing all of this or if it really is helping with like whatever I'm doing with my skin and whatever I'm taking is that I started taking this like Swiss brand grapeseed and I usually take like, it's two tablets for, uh, I do it right before dinner. This is how it looks. I feel like this past like week or so, I started noticing like changes in my skin, especially early in the morning. And if you can tell like my skin tone on my face, like my hands are super tan from like the sun and all of that, but like, my face is actually close to the color of the rest of my like untanned skin. So yeah, so honestly, I don't know if it's the products or what, but since I'm seeing a lot of good changes, I thought I would share this with you guys. Last but not least, I have to put on lip balm. I have very, very dry lips. This is, they call it a lip mask. It's Moisturizing Ginseng Lip Mask by Floresis. It's one of like my favorite. But anyways, that concludes tonight's skincare routine without the face mask and without the Medicube device. So a more like everyday kind of nighttime skincare routine. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like, comment, and or subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.